When do you expect Troy to practice again? That's a great question. I, mean, I think it could be seven to ten days just to be 100% sure. And then hopefully that Wednesday before going to the Penn State is ready to go. Thoughts on the way that you You know, I felt that uh, the Harvard game really played well when we watched the tape. The Jeans are faded play a heck of a lot better than the coaches down south. Dartmouth uh, could have been one of our, uh, our worst performances this year in the fact of uh, scoring chances, better scoring chances that uh, we normally don't. Talk about the, I'm sorry, can you talk about the play? What happened? Uh, it's, uh, it's kind of a weird play. Uh, it's, it's a odd man rush type situation. I slid across to the post to my left side. Uh, ended up just off that post. I uh, got up off the knees and saw a guy coming in. Uh, I think he tripped up. He came in uh, on his knees pretty much at full speed. Tried to jump over him. Didn't get over him, obviously. Ended up pretty high in the air and just landed on So you have to work on your vertical leap a little bit? Yeah, probably. <laughs> uh, I'll make sure that Coach Gaylord uh, is working on my jumping. Is there a sense of relief of the little reaction? Obviously, what you, as you said, could have been on a month, maybe longer, and now there's a chance you're playing the next set of games. Yeah, it's huge relief. Uh, like I said, anytime something that serious uh, comes back up and uh, MRI is negative. You always want to be out there as a competitor. Um, you always want to be out there practicing, getting better at playing somebody else. Did you think it was ACL or MCL or anything like that? Uh, I mean, originally it was LCL, I think. Um, so I never had, uh, I never, I just knew it hurt originally. Um, but the, the original thought was LCL. Um, and then it came back up. LCL's fine, it's stable, no tears. So. Or how do you feel right now? Yeah, right now it's just a little sore and stiff, but uh, you know, just take it a day at a time and uh, work with Cheryl every day, rehabbing it. Should be good to go pretty soon. Obviously, you never want to get injured, but the timing of the injury with the exam break coming up, I mean, is it probably a good, good time to be you know, taking care of that? Well, yeah, like you said, you never want to be injured, but um, obviously having a bye week helps. Um, so it's, uh, it always sucks to be hurt, period. I mean, Missing practice is never a good thing, but uh, at the same time, if you know that you've got a couple weeks to prepare for your next game, then uh, it's, it's better then than if you're playing on Friday. With the break that you guys have, and then the fact that the next game is until Saturday, do you feel like you know if things go well, do you, do you expect to play in the next game? Yeah, I'm, I'm not anticipating any time off, but um, you know, I, that's just me. When they told me that it's a possibility, that uh, that's what I'm setting my mind towards. So we're just taking it a day at a time, and obviously that's the goal, and, and we'll see how it goes. But uh, right now it's a day at a time process, and uh, hopefully I'm ready to do it. Do you expect to get back on the ice maybe right after exams? Are you uh, just not doing uh, any skating know, right now? Just like, just like I said, we're taking it a day at a time. And, um, just focusing on rehabbing. I'm pretty good getting the swelling down, and, and we'll get to that. What was the first reaction, everybody? Uh, see what happened. I just turned around. I went for the nearest guy who was around him. So uh, thankfully, it's we heard it's day to day, and he's doing better now. And 
good. He has a lot of damage to his knee, so we're happy about that. And we definitely have full confidence in Steve to take over here for however long it goes out. And we're ready to go. Is there a break, obviously, coming up? I mean, what do you guys do? Is it nice to take, to take a little break right now? Uh, definitely a little break. I mean, it's not a break on our minds. We've got exams and everything going hard right now. It's definitely nice. Good morning practices, no afternoon, so it's going good. Thoughts on how last week was going to your thoughts on what you uh, uh, I mean, we went to Harvard, did what we had to do there, but we finished the job. We only got four points there. We only got two. And Dartmouth was a little bit tricky for us. We wanted to play our best game there. We expect to come out next weekend. I have to imagine, obviously, the time off is nice. I mean, you guys are doing some schoolwork stuff, but is there a sense of we want to be playing games? You, is time off something you enjoy or not? Uh, it's, it's good to have time off, but I mean, definitely want to be playing games. I, mean, I don't like watching all the other games going on. And, I mean, yeah, you definitely want to be playing games. This situation with Troy, obviously, it's a good thing, I guess, for him, the timing of it, that maybe he gets a little time to rest. You, you know, you, you deal with bumps and bruises and injuries, and sometimes you catch a break here. Right? Uh, yeah, it's definitely great great timing for him, great timing for all the team. Some, some of the guys are beat up right now, and uh, it's a good time for all of us to get back to it. And get